Tell me about how your whole music career got started. I heard you were discovered on MySpace. I made a MySpace page at like the last two weeks of MySpace. Yeah. You know what I mean? Before like everyone deleted theirs. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I was booking shows like by myself, you know, on MySpace, like getting a hundred dollars to like drive to Arizona with a bunch of my friends and you know play, and I was just grinding it out and. Uh, I got on a tour and I hopped on and did 60 shows and the rest is kind of history, man. Good Just for never you, stopped. man. Good for you. Well, you made it. You I made, I, yeah, I made and it. And there's a handful of people out there that did not. <laughs> and they're in this category right here that we like to call still on MySpace. Take a look. <laughs> Yeah, I'm ready for the compat. It be compat, I be compatible. You be no passionate. You know when you're done. I'm compatible. I see the internet. Yes! Yes! I know this song word for word. You know this song. I do. Why must I cry? Man, maybe this guy did make it. Why must I cry? Why you gotta wipe his ass while he's here? You did that earlier. <laughs> Get a load of this bra. Don't you love this bra? Oh my god. I could scream yee She's like one of those horror movie dolls, don't she? Yeah. Oh my god, it looks like a zombie death angel. <laughs> man will love it. Oh man will love it. It's a candy bra. Pause it. Ladies and gentlemen, they're in the crowd, man. <laughs> sipping on and dripping on. Si hey, do it for me right now. Yo, we're sipping on, we're dipping on, we're tripping on, we're flipping out. What? Flipping out, dripping out, tripping out, sipping out. What? Flipping out. Yo, straight off MySpace, straight onto Facebook. <laughs> okay, Travis, you're also really active with your fan base, so you talk to them on, on all the social media. Definitely. Uh, we found a video where it's a girl's dream for you to recognize her and notice her on social media. And, and, and you do. I do. You know, and, and it's one of the sweetest reactions I've ever seen. Take a look at this. So obviously she must have tweeted. If you were to tweet me, I would just start crying. And he said, start crying, girl. <laughs> I feel bad now for responding. Like, I feel like I maybe shouldn't have responded. I'm gonna tell you what, you just created something so special. Whew. They're called dream tears. Dream tears. <laughs> because when you have dream tears, the greatest moment of your life just occurred. Take a look. I'm so happy, I'm crying. <laughs> What'd you get? I don't know what it is, but I'm about to lose my <laughs> Possessed. I bet her dad was the same way about these boots. <laughs> no, hell no. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! His voice just changed like three octaves. <laughs> also, hey, hey, you're adopted! <laughs> How do you feel about Taylor Swift? Uh, I don't know how, but she's so perfect. I love her so much. Is she drunk? <laughs> she's drunk off the energy of Taylor Swift, OK? Wait, why are you crying? Are you sad? No, I'm so happy. Uh, uh. She's, she was in the same room as me, and she's so amazing. Uh. <laughs>
honey, as your father, I'm gonna need to put this video on the internet. <laughs> Next question, Jeff, where are you? Right there. Pause yeah. it. Just for context and perspective, these are all former wrestling superstars. They are doing what I'm assuming is a local meet and greet somewhere in Wisconsin. <laughs> I just want to thank each and every one of y'all for all you've done to your bodies. <laughs> it's still real to me, damn it! <laughs> May I taste you, gentlemen? <laughs> There you have it. Wrestling's real. We'll be right back with more ridiculousness. <laughs>